don't think my aunt likes shrimp. What What's are this? you doing? Trying to take my job? Get in here right now. We're going in? I don't know anything what's going on. Is that good? That was amazing. Okay, great. <laughs> Welcome to the Shrek Quarters. <laughs> hey, hey, Braille people. Um, what's up? We uh, we have a skate park here. This is the sister park. It really is, right? You turn around and show the skate park. Look. See, we have all that. Um, but we also have a distribution over here, and we're gonna we're gonna go we're gonna show you things. And you're watching this, so you're gonna be shown. All right. That was a fantastic kick, by the Thank way. Thank you. I, I've told you, my inner my inner donkey is just it's here today. They said they've had to replace the door many times. That's why it has a, a men's sign on it. Oh. There's a men's room somewhere with no door on it. <laughs> We're not gonna do bathroom tours, but no. we have skateboards. I mean, unless the people want to see it, but that gets kind of weird. There's like a sink broken in there, and I don't know why. Uh, here it is. Wow. We prepared for you so lovingly and got this very clean for you. And this will eventually go out to recycling, but we have a lot of skateboards on these shelves. We have shoes over there. What is this? Skateboard. Oh, it's your face. Sorry. Parody Mario, right? Now we're cool? We're clear? All right. We're clear. clear. We're clear. Here's a super rare skateboard. Oh! Yeah. Actually, I need to give this to the artist. That's why I have this. But this was like, this is like a 1 and 150. And we just had some from the initial print. And uh, they don't exist anymore. This is our collab with uh, MetaZoo, which is a card game. And this is like a dream, like a dream. I'm still, I nerd out on this every time it exists because I grew up in a card shop playing games. And we did a collab with them and I'm really hyped on it. <laughs> uh, orders in process of preparing to go out for the day. Oh, uh, mine. This dude, re uh, Javier doesn't need his. You can take that one. Okay. okay. Uh, there's our good dude, Alex Buning. He's been in this operation since its inception. I've been working with you the longest. Yeah, we've been working a while. I said, let's make a skate video. And then it evolved into him holding this cardboard box. I like this box a lot. That's a good box. It's a great box. This is a nice ball, too. Dude, this is. <laughs> He's the greatest plastic ball, dude. Bad this for the is environment. dense. <laughs> oh, is, okay, yeah. That being said, it does exist and that comes on the products that we receive. And we reuse it to That's get some, some pleasure out of it. That's a weird word to say. <laughs> uh, enjoyment. Enjoyment, and yes. We, so we made a big one. Uh, and we made uh, Jason Park do some stupid creative stuff with it, I, and it was I very already, entertaining. I can already imagine. Yeah, and I was like, dude, make one of those balls again. Except I wasn't on the phone, I was talking to his face. Um, so how long has this side of the warehouse been here? We pretty quickly evolved into and grew into this. Uh, it started with a smaller warehouse over there, which we technically can get into, but it's somebody else's, so we shouldn't. Maybe not put that on the internet, right? But Or do? Yeah, we don't care. Um, then we grew into that one, and we were running the distribution, and the skate park was in one. And then as we grew, we were like, let's do it whole room just distribution because this came available you know ever since then so i would say we started the warehouse world at 2014 and then we were probably in here by 2016 right so it's been nine years wow right after aaron and doug went pro whenever that was yeah we could find out but i would love to show you this empty shelf that is the most amazing thing i've ever seen yeah it's beautiful hollow you guys done a hollow deck yet yes I, i'm actually skating one are you yeah oh okay there's braille done a hollow, hollow deck yet no no dude you should it's fun Fun. So right here is where like uh, different multiple people that put together packages that go out. Uh, right now, Alex is working. We got Ryan Chambers who does our uh, apparel, which is over there. We have a whole printer for apparel. That's pretty cool. Uh, there's our wheels. You want a set of wheels? Uh, yeah. What, do you, what size do you skate? Uh, 52. 52. That's easy. You want a T-Rex? Sure. We love Doug. Doug T-Rex. There you go. Thank you. Do you want wheels? I have wheels. Okay. Thank you. Does anybody else want wheels? <laughs> so, appreciate it. We used to have all of our shirts prepped up and ready to go, but we switched over to a print on demand uh, in house. So we have a lot of, we should utilize this space, Brian Ames. Yeah, we should. Like a poker table. No, well, that would be cool, but. A roulette table? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dude, I'm into roulette. Uh, odds and ends over here, um, like this. Like, I don't, I don't even know this existed. What is this? That's what the Hey, heck? can I have this? Sure. Is this uh? <laughs> Wait, whoa! How many things you have, whoa. dude? Whoa! I like this. I've been trying to get your attention this entire time. <laughs> We're gonna and you have not known. We are gonna do a need side quest. Let's see how much do. stuff he can steal. Okay. I, my mission has been foiled now. <laughs> I like how he has multiple mugs. <laughs> Uh, so every morning we come in and uh, once the orders are prepped, we print them right here. Uh, Casey over here, who's a good dude, been involved. Hi. Actually, I, how old were you, like 18 when we first met at Skate Naked? Yeah, I was 18. Seven. It's a skate park name, by the way. It's called Skate Naked. So if you say I'm going to Skate Naked, like I, you mean you're going to the skate park, but it sounds like a different sentence. Uh, I don't even know why there's a beer. This is Ryan Chambers' desk, and he has easily the coolest desk here. Every day. I don't know what to think. I, Pretty I cool stuff. I love Harry Potter. This is Brian. Brian, do you still use this as a photography table? So product shots and stuff. 
for instance, we did like a, a movie parody board. We went to a theater and got a bunch, a big bag of popcorn. They just gave it to us for free. Wow. FYI, if you just ask for things, you can get stuff in life. So we had a big <laughs> bag of popcorn, which we ate too. You were to buy it, it'd be like a thousand dollars worth of popcorn. Not thousand dollars, but a lot. Was, I mean, you know, like a small, a small popcorn is like sixteen dollars. Oh, oh yeah, yes. At the, at the, I thought you meant like just making that many. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. No, no, it's like five cents if you just actually make it. So this is a uh, our unorganized stuff. We actually, we used to have a projector up there, and then the fire department, after like ten years, they were like. This is actually not okay. Wow. I don't know. They didn't care the other times they came through, but recently, so we took it down. Uh, but we used to be able to play like Mario Kart and stuff. This is the dustiest like Wii U ever. So this is the, uh, dude, Brian, the sauna. We were, it was New Year's Eve. Wow. I was at dinner. My wife and Brian Ames and his wife. He's mentioned saunas being like, I just thought a sauna would be like $5,000. He's like, oh no, did you get one for like a thousand bucks or 2,000 bucks? I ordered it at dinner. And then the next <laughs> week, a sauna came from Amazon. I got it on Amazon too. And it's super easy to put together. And I don't know if we've used it in a while. I, I think I used it as a sound booth recently, but we used to use it all the time. Brian, can you explain this for us right here? My, this is my refrigerator that doesn't work anymore. That's full of expired hot sauce. No. Sure. Absolutely. No! This is my refrigerator, we'll fake it. But don't put that in there. This is my refrigerator full of hot sauce. And wow. so I use hot sauce with like every meal. And so I have an entire refrigerator dedicated to it because I took up that entire refrigerator and I felt bad. So I moved it all to this small one. So my fridge of sauce. Cool. That is We're gonna sick. get you I eating like hot that. sauce today, JD? Pro I hope not. <laughs> no. Crack the case. <laughs> oh my gosh. Heavy duty. Uh, and in here, uh, there's probably even more space in here. We have a skate park, uh, but thank you for hanging out with us. Everyone could go through that door. Drive safe. Yeah, you... Or don't, it's your choice. Yeah, you gotta. You gotta leave now? Yeah. yeah. It was a pleasure. Yeah. Maybe next time I'll skate. <laughs> you gotta go. Does that yeah, mean I can kick the door again if I were left the Yeah. Now you're throwing stuff? Get out now, please. Garlic dillies? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, we gotta go, right? Who's yeah. eating the garlic guys? Okay, guys, have a good one. Thank you for having us. It's, I'm serious, man. I'm gonna lock it. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Cool. Bye. Yeah. Bye. Okay. That's, all right. All right, that's it. Let me, let me close the door? Yeah, dude, come on. Are you All right. the skate park now? I'm nice again, I promise. Uh, what? We're trying the skate park now? Which ramp do you want to show first? That one. No, you pointed to the, that ramp, or the, the bank first. Okay. Brian! 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 I should have thrown it harder. Uh, all right. So right here we have our bank to ledge. The five stair slash, what do you call this? Structure? The five yeah. stair structure used to be taller, and this was like just level. But then we made it like this, which uh, is just more to skate. Every, we're trying to evolve it and change it to, you know, I'm sure you guys do the same thing. So a few people have actually done tricks over this. I think the best thing is probably like a full cab, but it's kind of hard to like Get throw speed. down and actually yeah. go over. I just ollied it and I was like, not my thing. Uh, but it's super fun to just start over there, get speed and do tricks this way. Uh, there's been a few tricks that have grinded all the way that way and then like tried to push back or manuals and push back. Uh, that's cool. This gap doesn't look that big, but it's the hardest gap in the skate park. There's not a lot of roll up and it's just kind of like low and long. Uh, but what's the best nollie inward heel flips probably the best trick? You guys want to try to outdo that at some point today? All right. Front pop uh, Yep, here's the five stair. It used to be like tall. You go to anywhere in the world, a measurement of a five stair is like eight to 10 inches long and like a certain amount high. Ours were 14 inches long. Don't ever say this on the internet, by the way. It goes like, it's a normal size five stair. It was a big five stair, so we mellowed it out because we wanted a bump to bar. That would never have happened with the massive structure we had here before. So the thing that sucks is that we lost the, the size of the handrail. This is a better like practice. Huh? Yeah, this is this gets you better for street rails way better than than our old actual handrail did. Mm -hmm. But I never got to keep them for granted. Right now, the way the park is is the best flow it has ever had because you you can go this way both ways. You can turn and do that. You know, it, it's just something to keep going. You got a big quarter there to wall ride and get speed to come back here. So uh, this is probably one of the, the first things people are like, "What the heck is this? This is our 20 stair." I can't believe we were the first people to do this, right? <laughs> it is, yeah. Like no one's built a micro 20 stair, so you could at least like technically say you did. You know, I've seen people roll up this and oh, back really? 80 and stuff. Yeah, you can do a lot. Of have you seen the, seen the hunter's stair? I have, yeah. Okay. That's on YouTube somewhere. I think this is the most fun thing to skate, is just these bump 
to ledges. Uh, it used to be, this deck also used to be a little taller and the ledges seem shorter. And once we dropped it, the ledges visually look taller and it's funny, it's the same obstacle, but it messes with you so much. I would three flip 5-0 this and now, or like double, I did double flip back tailed it. And now I'm like, dude, I'm like, K flip 5-0 freaks me out and I gotta like, kind of like warm up to it now. But it's it's crazy, it looks way better on film though. And you guys are all talented, you'll do all those tricks. Uh, curve quarter pipe, this is just one of those things where like, what can we do to bring something new to the park? I'd say there's a lot of stuff that hasn't been done on that. Baby dubs. This is really, we don't need both of these. This is beautiful. But this is just the best training wheels for a gap ever. Same with this rail. This is just like the perfect size, fun rail down something. That being said, I'm still a wuss these days at rails. I used to be not. This is kind of like a baby hubba that you can, you, you, we typically put it down the double set. It was originally somewhere else, uh, but it's fun if you want like a little ledge down the double set. Mm -hmm. um, this was, we just wanted to utilize this space. We built it this year. Not much has been done this way. Like, I feel like there's a lot of stuff there. Brian Ames Smith the tall part though. Oh, that was wow. crazy. But it's fun to do tricks like this way and then go into the bank. Uh, this is literally just, we had the ramps, so we put them on the wall. Nothing more of that. Fair. Standard box. So this is a rebuild. The first thing when we were in the smaller warehouse was this box. It was Sam Tabor's original box from when he was a teenager. We skated it so much it was mushy and gross. Ooh. It would have been alive for like 15 years or something crazy. So we rebuilt it and it's like a tank. Mini ramp. Uh, yeah. That's a mini ramp. We wish we had your mini ramp though. That's the greatest thing of all time, right? No. Uh, the C-Box, this is also one of the newer things. We have it made so you can turn it around and skate a normal box, and I don't think we ever are gonna want to turn it around. Yeah, this is amazing. This is so much fun. The only thing is when you fall, watch out for this. I Ooh. fell and I just barely like hit that and it felt like somebody like shanked me. It was bad. Oh, what is this? This is the Warehouse Wednesday scoreboard for the year. Ooh. So lately they've been on a run. Like people have been winning all the time, but like it's the year of no mercy. Probably wasn't until April that somebody won. Wow. Like I had to do like a back, back, a three flip dark lip slide. Like that was my challenge. Like, wow. like really hard stuff. But then at the end, basically I do a little award ceremony, which you guys, you guys will be in that. I'll mail, I'll mail it out. Win or loss, yes. Rick. Um, and then we do a best trick of the year. Uh, only in Warehouse Wednesday. So if you don't do it on Warehouse Wednesday, it doesn't count. Yeah, don't worry about that. But I could give you a montage of those tricks. It could be cool. Baby quarter, and we, there's two of them, so you technically could make a baby mini, but we just, we've only done that once. This is the, our biggest ramp, just to get speed going that way. Mm -hmm. This is the, the first quarter we ever made, and it was too steep. Uh, one, there was another one, it doesn't exist anymore, but, but it is kind of cool to be able to like, one ollie up this way and grind that way, and you can, you can come off there. Yeah, or this is like, training right here. Yeah, grind there. You have to come see our boat ramp. Do you think I could drop in on it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. All right. You're either gonna fall very hard, or you'll do it. Well, that, that's that's, kind of what that is a matter of fact. Yeah. Uh, we have a loop too, which is only. Yeah. Alex is the only that. person to do it. But I, I have an idea for that. You can. Yeah. JD, oh, you're on. We want to. <laughs> we want to build a bigger one, but it's fun for like RC cars and stuff too. All right. That is the shred quarters. Well, thank you very much. Yeah. Oh, and the skateboards. But we've made too many skateboards. Like we just don't even put them on the walls anymore. Oh really? But we have them. Four years out of date. The rest of them are on the other side on the well, trip. Right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, Jay Dizzle, I'm putting you in charge. Where's the first place we're gonna skate? The first place we are skating is over that cone because it's not really like a built-in obstacle. So we gotta skate stuff that you can move around through. Okay.
Yeah! Yeah, glow. Yeah, JD. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yep, sounds good. Yeah, Rick! Why was I talking when that was happening? <laughs> Explosive mode right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, I'm feeling good, but I can't skate. No way! No way! How many times? <laughs> Oh! 
But uh, thanks for hanging out. All right. I'm excited. All right, we're, we're gonna leave again. Okay. So, yeah, let's go. Bro! Okay. Yeah, go. Bro, that was actually terrible. What was that? I thought it was higher than it was. <laughs>